I'm Andrew. I'm Tyler. We're here with handguns. Hello. Can you guys say who you are and what you guys do? My name's Taylor and I sing in the band. I'm Jake and I play guitar. So you're on tour right now with Ico 5s and where the union has been going so far. Great. she has been awesome. I mean, turned out some great listeners we've ever done. Yeah, very cool. <laughs> Works for us, Tyler. Thank you. Um, so, how is uh, or how the kids are responding to you guys so far on tour as you get further away from your hometown? All the sh all the shows on this tour have been great. We've been back and forth across the country like five times this year. So, yeah. So, yeah. This isn't this isn't our first tour. We've uh, so we have decent followers in all areas. So it's cool. When, there's definitely you see the same people from out the windows. Is there a like, a specific region besides your hometown obviously that has greater draws or turnouts? Um, we do play uh, this place called Midland, Texas. There's a venue there called the Pot and it's like, kids go wild. It's insane. It's like one of the best places to play for us. It's awesome. So, uh, do you trade off? Uh, on this tour, headliners every night, or is it a fixed lineup? Since you're all pretty like what, what we do is, it's there's definitely areas where each band is bigger than the other one, so it's like it just depends on. We all, we all pretty much know where we do well and where we where we don't do well. So it's like we've never played here before. We'll play first. Okay. You know what I mean? So the bands that are bigger in the circuit. Uh, moving on to your recent release, which is "Don't Bite Your Tongue." singing about it, pretty much all based off you got off of what you guys did. That's awesome. That's banging. I didn't even know that. Yeah, I, def I, I don't that feel rules. like we started a trend. I hope we did. That's, yes, that's we did. Cool. Don't butt your tongue. <laughs> don't paint do it. it. Paint it on your notebook. That's cool. Spray paint it on bathroom walls. Spray paint it on top covers. <laughs> or your best friend's nipples. <laughs> that's <Man>. dedication. <laughs> then speaking of don't bite your tongue, when you guys first... I believe announced the album title. You guys create a uh, Tumblr page for yeah. Don't Bite Your Tongue. And you guys open up emails for fans all around the yep. nation and world for whether well, they're just talking about hardships, struggles, etc. Um, what was your, like, what did you guys intend to do for that? Like, why? It was just, we, we wrote a record that was about not holding back and we just, it was just an idea we came up with to do it. We were like, I think it was either me or our merch guy that came up with it, and our merch guy Tucker, and we just thought it fit. We thought it was a good idea. There was no real in-depth reason. We just did it. It was definitely fun because I know I submitted an email. I was talking to uh, you actually, Taylor, hey, and we emailed a few, a few times back and forth. It's it, was awesome. kinda, it was fun. Hell yeah, man. Hey, you're a funny guy. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you. So. Uh, a little more serious question here. What went through your mind when you guys decided to become a full touring band, like constant touring band, instead of like retaining full-time jobs or going to school? Uh, were you nervous or excited? What went through your heads? When this, uh, when I kind of made the decision to go on tour, I just kind of, I was kind of wasting away at home, I guess. And I don't know. I felt like I wasn't doing anything, I guess. Yeah, it's the same thing. Just love music and had to go. Pretty, much all there was Pretty to easy it. decision. Yeah. 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 Very cool. So what is next for handguns? New records or new tours coming up soon? You wanna feel, you wanna feel this one? <laughs> um <laughs> This is you dog. Well I'm actually gonna be leaving the band. Uh, but Tyson from second to last is going to fill in. It's, they're still going to tour. Um, Tyson from second to last is going to fill in for the rest of the summer. And then they're going to see where, where they go from there. And Jake's been writing guitar parts for a new record. There will definitely be a full length for them, I believe. So 
We don't know who the the next we, singer is going to be, yeah. but uh, Tyson from Second to Last is filling in for all the tours that we have booked right now. So don't worry, you're not going to not. If you're planning on seeing us, you're going to see us. Um, then after that, we're going to see what's good. And we're going to figure out what's up with another singer and keep going. Um, I started this band two, three years ago by myself, and there's been like 13 ex members, and I don't know. I'm just not ready to. I'm not ready to throw in the towel yet. So, and our drummer is also leaving. He was just uh, he was a new guy, and just Taylor's leaving, and it, it just didn't work out with him. So we're getting a new drummer, and currently our bassist is staying, and we're gonna find another singer and keep going. That's all there is. There's really no other. That's all there is to it. Awesome. So last question on a less serious note: If you could create three events for the pop punk olympics what would they be okay. you got three events for the pop like could it be like anything yeah, anything. anything i feel there should be what this is called. what's the thing where you what are they dunking boots or something wait but that wouldn't be a never mind like, like a dunk tank be, yeah but that's not very yeah <laughs> could you do that that's not very Olympic. You could have a dunk booth in the Olympics. It's pop punk Olympics. You don't have to be <laughs> any athlete. Jake, you gotta help me out. I have no idea. <laughs> Olympic events for pop punk. <laughs> I don't have no idea. How many dick jokes you butt can make? Naked, butt naked lawn door? <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. I feel like I feel. a dick joke competition might be. I don't know. That, that would seem to do pretty awesome. I, I feel, at least in my book. I'm trying to. Last one had to be, would have to be awesome though. Like, I don't know. What would be the tiebreaker? Stage dives. Stage dives. That'd be cool. That'd be the tiebreaker. Yeah. Sta the yeah. Okay. Yeah. I can get down with that. Sure. Well, now that we have our Olympic events, uh, I think we're pretty much done. Oh yeah. Dude. Thank you guys. Thank you else very much. What's up? Is there anything else you guys want to add? Nope. Um, there's no black, bad blood between me and the band. So Taylor's actually that. quitting the band because he's going to be a monk. And then I'm going to open my own chain of fast food restaurants. We are proud of ourselves. That's it. That's awesome. All right. All right well, well, thank you very much. Thank you.